The Spark app just got a major overhaul for use with the dynamic new Spark Live. Let's check it out. The new Spark Live is a 150 watt, four channel smart amp and PA system packed with amps, effects, a mixer, and is your live solution for playing with the full band, solo, or however you like to jam. Channel one is optimized for guitar and bass. Channel two is optimized for dynamic microphones, bass, acoustic guitar, or a balanced instrument input. And finally, channel three and four is for instrument or line level inputs. For both channels one and two, we can add and adjust our amps and preamps and effects in the Spark app. With these additional channels on the Spark Live, you'll now see some updates to the app, including new effects and preamps. So let's dive in and see what's new. So I'm in the Spark app and have the Spark Live connected. In the top left corner, this box indicates the current channel we're adjusting. Tap it to toggle between channel one or channel two. Channel one works exactly the same way as previous Spark models. We simply have our signal chain presented at the top where we can toggle effects and amps on or off as we please. So nothing new there. When we move over to channel two, you'll notice some differences. As channel two is designed for instruments that typically use a preamp, like acoustic, vocals, or bass, channel two does not have access to the guitar amp section, but it does include all the Spark 40 effects pedals to complement the new selection of preamps and vocal effects. The three preamps available to us are the preamp 73 for vocals, the acoustic preamp, and the bass DI for bass guitar. The signal chain is also slightly different for channel two. From left to right, we have effect block one, where we can choose from any of the sparks, gate, compression, wah, or drive effects. There's the preamp block that we've just covered. Then we move on to effects block two, where we can choose from our modulation, EQ, or delay effects. And finally, there's effect block three, where we can select from any of our reverb effects. Now let's take a look and listen to the new effects available on the Spark app, many of which are catered to vocals when using a dynamic microphone in channel two. We'll use the vocal preamp in combination with these effects. First off is the Compressor 76, a legendary compressor often found in high-end pro studios, suitable for any instrument. The next new effect is the Mic Compressor, a simple and effective compressor for vocals. Next is the vocal drive that has a light saturation setting, a heavy saturation setting, a lo-fi telephone setting, and finally a megaphone setting. The next new effect is vocal chorus. Add some thickness with this vocal chorus. The next new effect is vocal echo to add a delay effect for vocals. I'm going to adjust, adjust the, the delay, delay here, here and, and turn, turn up, up the, the feedback. feedback. Next is the vocal mellow reverb a warmer mellow reverb sound for vocals. Let's turn this level up a little bit. Finally, we have the vocal brilliant reverb, a bright and crisp reverb sound for vocals. Let's turn up that level a little bit. So those are all the new effects found in the Spark app. With the new Spark Live, channels one and two now have two banks of four onboard presets, and this will be reflected on the app. So if we tap on the preset button up the top here, you will now see bank A and bank B. And this is the same for both channel one and channel two. Previous Spark models will still just have the four onboard presets in one single bank. The Spark app also includes a comprehensive mixer view for use with Spark Live, which allows you to adjust the level for each individual channel on the Spark Live. To enter the mixer view, tap the menu tab on the bottom right corner and then tap on your connected Spark Live. Tap on Mixer View, and here you can adjust the level of each input channel as well as change the impedance settings. You can also control the overall master volume and also the music. This is any audio that's being streamed to the Spark Live. With the Mixer View, you're able to ensure you're getting the perfect mix all without having to adjust the physical knobs on the Spark Live. That's it for this rundown on the updates to the Spark app. Be sure to update your Spark app as it truly is the heart and soul of the Spark range and maximizes the experience with the Spark Live.